Uh, something else as well. And the, 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 Euro the European one. European one? Sorry, I'm forgetting how to freaking spell. another lion and yeah I'm not dealing with that Double checking, I didn't miss anything. East in this direction. Where? Oh, that's a big ass freaking cloud. And the dynamic weather is really nice. So there is one and there. <laughs> I sounded like a lion. Yeah, here when they mean tall grass, it is freaking tall grass. getting there in terms of getting to landmarks and taking them off That was a nice catapult, I suppose.
Ah, ok. Interesting. Damn. Okay. I imagine that's gonna be some lower bit about this place. already on the way so let's keep on going <clears throat> Bush Valley you say I've got to give this to the game that even if you go like get yourselves like a single reserve the DLC one like every reserve gives like there's so much variety even though there's like specific vibe and climate that you get it's still varied it's not like copy pasted you can get different things depending on the part of the uh, map you are which I appreciate very much i think it's very very freaking neat and we are getting there when in terms of like getting the landmarks of this map
I want to get to this safe house first because then I can go back, deal with the upper portion of the map, and then just fast travel here and continue journey. I'm all about unlocking those fast travel points. Okay, so there is something more, like, local points do not give you everything. Hmm. You know what, I'm fine. If, after I finish, if it turns out there's nothing more revealed to me, I, I will consider that I've done what I could and what I have. I'm gonna fast travel and then we continue here. Right. Let's fast travel. game is offering me that option so you can bet I will be using it although probably for this mountain I might wanna find the road first because it probably would have been problematic just Trying to go for the frick on the freaking mountain.
Hmm. This is not the lookout point. I'm like, okay. That is weird, but fine. So it feels like this section of the map is the most mountainous. Although I might be wrong. Uh, no, it looks like it's mountainous. Which, oh joy, I love me some hiking. It's like I'm sure there was something else here. Am I blind? No, I could have sworn there was something there. Yep, disabling the fast speed because I would never been able would have been able to get to that tower with it. Because it definitely screw something up with the um, You've got the hunter's sense. Follow those tracks. Yeah, there was something there. Um, hmm. Okay, let's go for this first. I suppose, but yeah, get to this place first. Then I'm gonna try to get up there and then just go down, and that will conclude this particular map. Took us an hour and a half, bare minimum. I 
I'll have to later determine if I want to render this in two or three videos. Probably three. Although probably doesn't mean that for sure. Oh yeah. Oh my word. Yeah, the, the views are... The views are something alright. Hmm. Hold on. Is that a cave? Because it certainly feels to me like it might be a cave. So I literally do not see any way of getting on top of that mountain. And the height makes me... yeah, sure it's probably a cave. Or maybe it's at the bottom of it, I don't know. Ah, most likely a cave. Hmm? Why is it so goddamn hard? Eesh! Not even a cave. I mean... So, but not fully. I could have travel, but you know what? It's it's. Whiff! <laughs> what was that? Okay, that's something cool. Yeesh! <sighs> yeah, I freaking have lost focus for a moment. Uh, all went to shit. Yeah, like legit trying to get to this point uh, without any cheese would have been like the hardest uh, part of this map. Like everything else is like, yeah, it's doable. Just looking that I didn't miss anything. This in those areas.
That's a nice view. And that does conclude this reserve. So just wanna double check. Make sure we have we have the savanna. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, that was savanna. We we did that. I'm pretty sure Medved Taiga we also did. I just want to make sure it actually is saved. For the game is a moment to load in. Uh, yup. Everything checked. We have that, then Savannah, we have that. Leighton Lake, I'm pretty sure I also did everything, and the Hirschfield, the European one also did. Yep, definitely did that. Although I think now that I look at it, it definitely gives a vibe that this map is bigger than the savanna. Although it might be just, you know, prick of the ice, I suppose. Okay, and then last check. For the European one, and then after the savanna. Uh, I'm gonna double check what. Parque Fernando. That's what we're gonna buy. Yeah, Hirschfelden Hunting Reserve. I f I'm pretty sure, yeah, we have that one as well. It feels there was a lot more stuff. Okay, so we kind of did four reserves, so like unlocking all the landmarks, all the fast travel points, and which means we still have. Assuming I didn't do any other, so we have Parque Fernando, Yukon Valley, Puerto Colinas, Silver Reach. The Avanda, Rancho del Arroyo, Mississippi Acres Reserve, Body Coast, that's 8, New England 9, Road Coast 10. Holy shit! Uh, there's a lot of reserves in this game. So let's see if we. Uh, because I could have sworn I did some, some stuff with Parque Fernando. Uh, if not, then I guess we have to. Go around and unlock some things. Hola, ¿qué tal? Escuchame. Welcome to Parque Fernando. Actually, apparently they we'll didn't. We'll keep this brief before my niece's pendejitos act up again. Oye, deja esto. Si la insultaste, debes pedirle disculpas. No me mandé disculpas. Okay, down to business. You came highly recommended as the warden to turn this slice of wild Patagonia into a world-class hunting reserve. Naturally, I expect you to hit the ground running, even though this is your first time here. Stretch your legs out. I'll start you off with some routine responsibilities. 
You can do this in any order. I don't care as long as you do the jobs well. I try not to micromanage. Well, not too much. To get the lay of the land, you'll want to go to the nearest lookout tower. Mark on your GPS. Climb on up and take in the view. Easy. There's also a hunting outpost nearby, and I'd like you to prepare it for upcoming guests. My gaucho friends do all the heavy lifting with the outpost. You just need to put on the finishing touches. Bring things up to the standard of a professional hunter, then bring them up a little more. Bitte. This place is my pride and joy, and you can see why. I name it for my husband, Fernando. May he rest in peace. Before he died, I made him a promise that this reserve, with all its abundance, would host the world's most elite hunters and feed the communities around it. Time to keep that promise. If you are reaching for a hunt, you can harvest some game for the construction crew building our central lodge. I like to keep the people who work for me fed and fed well. It helps them stay loyal. Our chef can prepare anything but a puma. See what you can find in the area. I'll chime in to help if you need it. Okay, so let's get to the I've safe house and then... I've been hunting here since my husband bought the place all the way back in 1979. You may have heard, I was a two-time back-to-back national champion in the 50-meter rifle. Three positions. I know guns. I know game. And my park nourishes the biggest, most exquisite free-range stacks you'll ever hunt. World records are set here. Some of them belong to me. Everything you need should be there. Set up the place. Finish so quickly. Maybe I like already. Yeah. If you're as good as I'm paying you to be, maybe you'll set some records yourself. But let's not cut this torta before it's baked. We've got a lodge to build, outpost to open, wilderness to explore. Now, that's one task finished. Two more to go. And if you see anything strange along the way, come straight to me and me alone. Mm. Loyalty is very, very important. It gives a vibe that the My map park is, is a paradise, but sometimes the Savannah? disloyal people who work here sure. have mala leche. You know, tough luck. You've dribbled the ball this far down the field. Now, score the final goal. Hear that? Time for esposas y jefas. Telenovelas are my only vice. Simona's going to find out the identity of her biological father. Is he Gaston or Facundo? It better be Facundo, que churro. Gaston and his lies can be trusted. No, no, no. Okay. So, that will be that for now. Uh, so we're gonna continue doing the... What was, what was the name of the reserve? Fucking hell. I'm... Yeah, Parque Fernando. Okay. Parque Fernando. <clears throat> so for now, uh, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this uh, episodes. And I will see you guys next time. Bye bye.